focus on your breath. Watch it all the way in, watch it all the way out. And then in again and out again. Just stay right here. The mind's not used to staying, it's used to traveling around. That's what samsara is all about. We think of samsara as a place, but it's actually something created by the movements of the mind. The more you move around, the more samsara there is. So try to be as still as possible. That way there are a lot fewer issues that you have to deal with. There are a lot of things that you could be thinking about out there, but you don't have to. The things that we're really responsible for are not all that much. You're responsible for your thoughts and your words and your deeds. The rest of the world that's going to go on without you. Someday we'll have to. In the meantime, you just let it go, because you've got to focus right here, because this is where you really can make a difference. What you do and what you say and what you think, it all comes out of your intentions. And where are the intentions doing their work? They're doing it right here, right next to the breath. So this is a good place to be as you watch your intentions and they begin to shape ideas about what you should and shouldn't be doing. When you stay with the breath, then you can watch these intentions a lot more clearly and decide which ones you want to go to, go with, and which ones you don't. So it's important that you get really established right here. This is one of the reasons why we talk about making the breath comfortable. If the breath isn't comfortable, the mind's not going to want to stay. It's going to go looking for pleasure. So instead of fighting its desire for pleasure, you give it a pleasant place to stay. That's why it's willing to look at things inside itself with a lot more fairness and objectivity. Because otherwise its feeling is that if it doesn't follow along with these urges and drives in the mind, it's not going to find any happiness. But you can show it. It's okay. There's a sense of well-being that comes from just being right here. And that way there's a lot less samsara that you have to go running around and trying to straight out, straighten out. So instead of traveling around, just learn how to settle in. It's a skill that many of us don't have. We can make an external home, but you're trying to make an internal home for the mind. It's a lot takes a lot more work, but it's work that's well paid, repaid. So learn how to settle in and have a sense of well-being, a sense of belonging right here. So that whatever comes up in the mind, you can see it clearly. You're not running off looking after other things. You're focusing your attention right here, where it's going to make the most difference. And if you have trouble staying here, well, it's the effort put into learning how to stay here that's really well spent. Because it's that's, that is what allows you to see clearly. And when you can see clearly, then you're much more in control of your own life, where it's going to go, what shape it's going to take. because you're well-established right here.